Hi everyone, Damien Fate here, and this is Undertale. I'm super excited to jump back into this game because I only played it for 15 minutes before during my viewer's choice event a couple of months ago, and it just seems like it's going to be a lot of fun to do, and I'm really happy that I'm going to be able to share this with you guys. This is an old school style RPG, so there's no voice acting, so I'll do my best to read out all the lines of dialogue so that people who can't read as fast will be able to keep up with the adventure. Long ago, two races ruled over Earth, humans and monsters. One day, war broke out between the two races. After a long battle, the humans were victorious, as they should be. They sealed the monsters in underground. They sealed the monsters underground with a magic spell. Many years later, dot dot dot, Mount Ebbett. 2000 X teen. <laughs> Legends say that those who climb the mountain never return. Well, I know what I'm not going to be doing. Oh, but check it out. Looks like I'm climbing the mountain. <laughs> and tripping on a vine. And so begins my adventure. <laughs> What's a child doing up there? Ooh. It's a very spooky cave. Okay. <laughs> Undertale. The name of the game. So it does look super old, but it came out in uh, September 2015, so it's really not that old. Um, I'm going to hit reset here. It's saying continue because I had the save file from before. Uh, but obviously, we're not going to be playing that. Yes, name already chosen. Yes, let's go, Damien. And here we are, in the cave, in a bed of flowers. Um, yeah, let's go explore. Oh, oh, my control's being a little bit weird. Never mind. It's a flower! Howdy, I'm Flowey. Flowey the flower. Hehehe. <laughs> Why'd you make me introduce myself? It's rude to act like you don't know who I am. Someone ought to teach you proper manners. I guess it's little old me will have to do. Ready? Here we go. See that heart? That's your soul. The very culmination of your being. My soul is a heart. My, uh, my control is acting a bit weird here. It keeps going to the left. <laughs> it's really worrying me. Oh no, that might, I might need to fix that after this battle. <laughs> Your soul starts off weak, but can grow strong if you gain a lot of LV. Which I assume is levels. Oh. What's LV stand for? Wild love, of course. You want some love, don't you? Don't worry, I'll share some with you. Aww. Down here, love is shared through little white friendliness pellets. Are you ready? Move around, get as many as you can! Okay! <laughs> oh no! I've been tricked! You idiots! In this world, it's kill or be killed! Why would anyone pass up an opportunity like this? Well, I'm in trouble. Especially since my, uh... Oh, die! <laughs> my, uh... My joystick's going off to the left randomly, I don't like it! <laughs> Ah! Oh, look! What a terrible creature, torturing such a poor, innocent youth. Ah, oh, do not be afraid, my child. I am Toriel, ta caretaker of the ruins. I pass through this place every day to see if anyone has fallen down. You are the first human to come here in a long time. Come, I will guide you through the catacombs. This way. Alright. Do I have to follow her, or can I go somewhere else? I'm gonna go this way. Oh, okay, sure. I'll follow you. Ooh. Fancy stuff. Are these petals? Oh, I guess they're just leaves. What is this? Uh, the shadow of the ruins loom looms above, filling you with determination. HP fully restored! Oh. Alright, yeah. Cool. I keep following this person. Welcome to your new home, innocent one. 
Allow me to educate you in the operation of the ruins. Buttons. Okay, buttons open doors. The ruins are full of puzzles. Ancient fusions between diversion and door keys. One must solve them to move from room to room. Please adjust yourself to the size of them. Okay. <laughs> These are buttons, got it. I can press any buttons I want, I guess. How's this say? Oh! Hang on, I wanted to see what the sign says. Uh, only the fearless may proceed. Brave ones, foolish ones. Both walk not the middle road. The middle road. What about this lever? Can't mess with that. Okay. To make progress here, you will need to trigger several switches. Do not worry. I have labeled the ones that you need to flip. Well, this is making it quite easy for me, isn't it? I want to press Z to read signs. Well, I'm not using a uh, keyboard. Thanks. Uh, stay on the path. <laughs> okay. Oh look, it's a it's a clearly labeled sign, a clearly labeled lever to pull. Okay. I talk to her. Go on, press the switch on the left. What if I press this one on the right? No, no, no! You don't want to press the you want to press the other switch. I even labeled it for you. Okay. Splendid. I am proud of you, little one. Let us move to the next room. Okay, sure. <laughs> As a human living in the underground, monsters may attack you. You will need to be prepared for this situation. However, worry not. The process is simple. When you encounter a monster, you will enter a fight. While you are in a fight, strike up a friendly conversation. Stall for time. I will come to resolve the conflict. Practic practice talking to the dummy. <laughs> okay. Hello, Mr. Dummy. How are you today? Oh. You've encountered the dummy! Oh my gosh. Uh... Do I do something here? Fight. Missed. I missed. Okay. The dummy looks like it's going to fall over. Uh... Act? Dummy. Talk. You talk to the dummy! It doesn't seem much for conversation. <laughs> Toriel seems happy with you. You win! You earned zero XP and zero gold. Aw, I don't get any experience with that. Ah, oh, very good. You are very good. Okay. Uh, talk to the dummy again. Goodbye, dummy. There is another puzzle in this room. I wonder if you can solve it. Alright, it's got something to do with these vines? Or the squiggly path? Whee! Where's the puzzle? Oh! Random encounter! Froggit attacks you! Let's, uh, let's compliment the frog. <laughs> Froggit didn't understand what you said, but was flattered anyway. Okay. Oh. She just stared it down. You get out of here, Mr. Frog. <laughs> okay, cool battle. How was the sign says? The western room is in the eastern room's blueprint. Oh. Uh, okay. Sure. Don't really know what that means. Oh. Spikes. This is the puzzle, but here, take my hand for a moment. Oh my gosh, this is humiliating. <laughs> You're not gonna let me do any of these puzzles myself? Well, okay then. Do I need to remember that to get back out of here? <laughs> I'll try to remember it. Also seem a little too dangerous for now. Oh my gosh. You've done excellently thus far, my child. However, I have a difficult request to ask of you. I would ask you to walk to the end of the room by yourself. Forgive me for this. <gasps> oh, this is so difficult. I have to walk all by myself? You've been holding my hand quite literally so far <laughs> through this game. There's nothing here. <laughs> I thought there'd be something going on. There's very thick bushes. Nothing in there? Okay. I keep thinking maybe I can climb the vines or something. Oh man, this is a challenge. There's not even any random encounters. Oh! A pillar? Okay. <laughs> she was hiding behind it. Greetings, my child. Do not worry, I did not leave you. I was merely behind this pillar the whole time. Okay. Thank you for trusting me. However, there was an important reason for this exercise. To test your independence. I must attend to some business, and you must stay alone for a while. 
Okay, that's fine. Please remain here. It is diff dangerous to explore by yourself. I have an idea. I will give you a cell phone. Oh, that sounds quite nice. If you have a need for anything, just call. Be good, alright? It's kind of weird in this old school style game to get a cell phone. Hey, I can't fit behind there. Oh well, whatever. Can I call? Oh look, cell phone. Say hello. Call her mom. <laughs> Flirt. <laughs> Let's say hello. This is Toriel. You only wanted to say hello? Well then, hello. I hope that this suffices. Hee <laughs> hee. Okay. <laughs> oh, now she's calling me. Hello, this is Toriel. You've not left the room, have you? There are a few puzzles ahead that I've yet to explain. It would be dangerous to try and solve them yourself. Be good, alright? That's weird. <laughs> she called me straight back. It's a froggy. Can I talk to the frog? Rabbit, rabbit. Excuse me, human. I have some advice for you about battling monsters. If you act a certain way or fight until you almost defeat them, they might not want to battle you anymore. If a monster does not want to battle to fight you, please. Use some mercy, human. Ribbit. Okay. Good to know. Ribbit, ribbit. Excuse me, human. Oh no, it's gonna go through all that again. No! Skip! 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 <laughs> uh, so this is like a safe spot, right? Oh. Frog, it hopped close! No, I don't want to fight it. Hop, hop. Oh! Alright, I have to dodge the, uh, the friendliness pellets. <laughs> the battlefield is filled with the smell of mustard seed. I don't know what that means, but hey, we're gonna compliment the frog. Frog, it didn't understand what you said, but was flattered anyway. Blushes deeply. <laughs> oh! Ah, nice try. Frog, it seemed reluctant to fight you. In that case, I can show mercy. Yay! I actually got some gold from that too. Oh, that's nice. Playfully crinkling through the leaves fills you with determination. HP fully restored. And I get to save it. Hooray. So it's nice. Usually in games where you can, uh, you can avoid enemies or make them flee or whatever, you don't get anything for it, which is kind of sad. It says take one. Take a piece of candy? Yes. You took a piece of candy. Open the menu. Okay. Monster candy. Should I use it? Oh, wait, how do I get info on it? I can't see any way to... Oh, here we go, info. Monster candy, heals 10 HP, has a distinct non-licorice flavor. Well, I'm full HP, so let's go ahead and save that for now. Alright, we'll continue our journey. More random battles. What is this? A Wimson. <laughs> Wimson approached meekly. Okay. Let's go ahead and, oh, terrorize or console it. I guess we'll console it. It does look kind of upset, doesn't it? Halfway through your first word, Wimsome bursts into tears and run away. <laughs> okay, sure. This is a very strange game. Uh oh. No! <laughs> oh, curses. Let me try that again. What did I crawl out of? An air duct? Wimson approached! Okay, I console you. Halfway through your first word, Wimson burst into tears and passed away. You won! I didn't get any gold that time though. Oh. Well maybe I can just go this way then. Yeah look, it's all it's all holes. I couldn't get past that. Uh Hello, this is Toriel. For no reason in particular, which do you prefer? Cinnamon or butterscotch? Wait, did that tell me? Is it cinnamon? No, it's actually... But, well... Uh, yeah, cinnamon, sure. Cinnamon's fine. Hee hee hee, I had a feeling. When humans fall down here, strangely, I... I often feel like I already know them. Aww. Truthfully, when I first saw you, I felt... Like I was seeing an old friend for the first time. Strange, is it not? Well... Thank you for your selection. Uh, sure. Oh, she's calling again? Hello, this is Toriel. <laughs> you do not dislike butterscotch, do you? 
I know what your preference is, but would you turn up your nose if I found you it's on your plate? <laughs> right, right, I understand. Thank you for being patient, by the way. Oh my gosh. I don't hate butterscotch, I just prefer cinnamon, I guess. Three out of four gray rocks recommend you push them. Three out of four gray rocks recommend you push them, okay. Oh, I thought the rock was fighting me for a, re a second there. All right, Wimson. I'm gonna console you. So you run away. Goodbye. <laughs> oh, well, that was easy. Just learning the basics here, right? So is this a doll? Because I can crawl out through that, right? Yeah. Oh, here we go. This is a lot of cracks. Oh! Oh boy. Oh. Wait, what does it say? Please don't step on the leaves. I'm stepping on the leaves. Oh. <laughs> Somebody got mad. Okay, Wimson. Goodbye. I'm not going to kill anything if I can avoid it. Because uh, we're just that kind of person. <laughs> okay, so let's try a little bit lower. Aha! Oh, wow. That was, that was pretty lucky. Uh, didn't you read the sign downstairs? What? What? Oh, right. Yeah, don't step on the leaves. Oops. <laughs> Uh, a mold small blocked the way. It looks like a jello. What can I do? I can imitate it or flirt with it. I guess I'll act like a jelly. You lie down immobile while with mold small. You feel like you understand the world a little better. Sexy wiggle. <laughs> oh, 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 oh gosh. It was attacking. The aroma of lime gelatin wafts through. It is a jello. Uh, should I imitate it again? That didn't seem to work. Should we flirt with it? It does have a sexy wiggle. You wiggle your hips. <laughs> Mold small wiggles back. What a meaningful conversation. Burble burb. Oh, it's attacking again. Okay. Oh my gosh. I am not very good at that. That was scary. Mold small burbles quietly. Hmm. If it burbles quietly, I think that means it's ready to be done, right? Can I, uh, show mercy? Yes! Okay, maybe it did that before too and I didn't realize. Okay. Oh! Right, these leaves are in the pattern of the, uh, the path I need to walk upstairs. That's what it was. Yes. No! <laughs> I just failed it! Straight away. It's okay. It's pretty near the beginning. Okay. <laughs> Wimson, you will be consoled until you flee. I wonder what happens if you terrorize it. That feels like a mean thing to do. Uh, okay, so it was down, up, and along. Don't step on the leaves. Down, right up. Okay. There we go. Oh, there's... Okay. I have to push the rocks on the switches. Uh, a pair of froggets hop towards you. A pair? Oh my gosh, can I compliment them both? No. Okay, one of them, oh, that one's, that one's, uh, blushing. Oh, oh. Oh my gosh, somebody flies. I'm intimidated by the, <laughs> the froggets raw strength. Only kidding. Uh, let's show mercy to the one on the left. And then we'll do the same to the one on the right. Although we need to, uh, compliment it. Oh my gosh. Uh, compliment, there we go. Froggy didn't understand what you said, but was flattered anyway. Blushes deeply. No flies! Oh! I caught one! Oh dear. Mercy! Yay! Four gold for that. Alright, let's push these rocks. Oops. Well there, partner. Who said you could push me around? Hmm? So you're asking me to move up? It's the rock talking. <laughs> <laughs> okay, just for you, pumpkin. Uh, okay. Can you move a bit more? Hmm, you want me to move some more? Alrighty, how's this? What? <laughs> huh? <laughs> that was the wrong direction? Okay, I think I got it. Thank you. 
Gosh. Silly rocks. Hey! <laughs> hey! Huh? You wanted me to stay there? You're giving me a real workout. Yeah, Mr. Rock. Oh, gosh. Two mold smalls. Block the way. Okay. Let's, uh, we have to flirt with it, right? You wiggle your hips. Mold small wiggles back. What a meaningful conversation. Oh, they're both squatching, though. Oh! Oh, that's weird that the bullets, um... Or pellets, whatever you want to call them, move in the same way for both of them. They wait pensively. Wait, let's, uh... Imitate the first one. Do I have to imitate it and then flirt? Ah, okay, one of them's burbling. That's the thing. Oh! <laughs> okay, mercy. Oh, they're both going, yes! All right. Let's get out of here. <laughs> hmm. Knowing the mouse might one day leave its hole and get the cheese. It fills you with determination. Oh. Okay. Oh, does that restore my health as well? I think it does. Uh, this cheese has been here quite a long time. It's stuck to the table. Oh, gross. What about this mouse hole? Oh! You're a little squeaky. <laughs> oh. That was like a dead ghost in the middle of the leaves. Yeah, was... Maybe I shouldn't walk on top of it. Oh. I have to talk to it. <laughs> it's sleeping. Are they gone yet? This, copes, this ghost keeps saying Z out loud repeatedly, pretending to sleep. Move it with force? No? Oh, I may have to. Okay. <laughs> okay, we're gonna move the ghost with force. I feel like this is not gonna end up well for me though. Sure. See? Here comes a Napster Bluke. Okay, let's act. Uh, oh gosh. What does check do, anyway? Napster Bluke. Attack 10, defense 10. This monster doesn't seem to have a sense of humor. Oh, I guess this would be a good way for me to find out what uh, different monsters like. So no sense of humor. Oh, I'm real funny. Oh, it's crying. Oh, ho, ho, ho. Napster Bluke is staring into the distance. Okay, uh, cheer it up, yeah. You gave Napster Bluke a patient smile. Huh. <laughs> really not feeling up to it right now, sorry. Okay. Napster Bluke just looks a little bit better. Uh, would flirting with the ghost work? Let's try. I just weigh you down. <laughs> I can hide just in this bottom right corner. That's easy. Uh, Napster Bluke looks just a little bit better. Okay, we're gonna cheer him up a bit more again. You told Napster Bluke a little joke. <laughs> oh, that's two hairs. That's good. Oh, but he's still crying. It'll be okay, Napster Bluke. Uh, cheering seems to have improved Ma Napster Bluke's mood again. Uh, can we. Can we show mercy now? Uh, oh. Oh, oh, oh my gosh, the tears are going crazy! The tears are going crazy, what? Oh. My gosh, okay. I don't like those crazy worm tears. Let me try. Oh! I call it Dapper Bluke. <laughs> Do you like it? Oh, well, nice hat. Eagerly awaits my response. Um, I guess flirting when somebody makes a hat out of tears is an appropriate response? Oh no. I usually come to the ruins because there's nobody around, but today I met somebody nice. Oh, I'm rambling again. I'll get out of your way. Oh, it worked! Success open. Now we have two ways we can go. Hmm. Next time on Undertale. Can we eat food made by spiders, for spiders, of spiders? <laughs> it is made of spiders, no!